Kuzuzang Pola, ladies and gentlemen. Kuzuzang Pola means hello in the local language here in Bhutan. And welcome to the another video. I want to start the video showing you where I'm staying. And uh, right now we are right next to the uh, airport, actually. And I'm going to spend two nights here in this beautiful city with amazing views. And uh, I want to show you what we are getting. I'm not paying for this room because uh, everything is included in the package I have paid already to uh, tourism agency in Bhutan. So they're managing everything. But I checked with the reception and this room itself costing around 50 American dollars for one night for one person. So which I feel like it's a great deal. And I'm going to show you why is it so. It's uh, the room, you can see already it's huge. Uh, only disappointing thing is that uh, I am not getting a double room, only uh, singles, but it's all good. I'm gonna manage, uh, I think, sleeping in the single bed. So uh, two beds separately. In this case, we have a heating system right now, which is great and it's super warm right now here. So this thing is actually working at the moment. So it keeps the room quite warm and nice. And uh, on the right side, we have a little TV and next to it, there's a space to open your luggage. I have my level eight luggage right here. There's a space to work, make coffee and some tea. There's a little wardrobe to put your things. I left my jacket right there. So this looks quite good and basic. I mean, I'm not expecting luxury stuff here and plenty of space here at the entrance and we have also a huge bathroom and the toilet area as soon as you enter on the left side we have the big sink area and also a little mirror in front of it uh, right in the middle we have the toilet and on the right side seems like uh, we do have the shower area so let's check this out beautiful so it comes with actually bath and at the same time rain shower which comes from the top which is interesting only thing is more interesting is that why this handle is right here and meanwhile you close the curtains it left <laughs> behind for some reason but cleanness it's great it's white everywhere and comes with all this clean towels as well and uh, we have a hand towel right here soap shower cap and some shampoo these are the basics and we have the hair dryer and another thing you notice it's so hot here because they actually have another heating system right here and it's also working at the moment and the shower it's much warmer than the room the bedroom itself so it's quite uh, quite good temperature especially during the nights considering that's that we are in the mountains so temperatures can get really cold and normally even in the dry season in a good season uh, during the night temperature gets below zero so it's quite freezing and i also have a little balcony area here check this out it's a uh, beautiful you can sit and have a coffee maybe and enjoy the views and i was mentioning that we are close to the airport and indeed we can actually see the runway right here so this is the only international airport in bhutan and whenever you are coming from foreign country you arrive here to this uh, airport and it has only one runway and it's considered one of the most dangerous international airports in the world it definitely falls to top 10 and um, when when we were landing um, i was coming from Kathmandu to here and i could understand why it's the most dangerous because you're just coming between the mountains so they have to do like an s shape and then after come down because they cannot just come like straight there is no way uh, because it's all covered with the mountains on this side as you can see on this side there are hills so only way is basically actually from the right side they come and land and then they lift off from 
uh, to this direction as well. So we can see the airport, and I think this is the only airport, uh, this is the only hotel I have ever stayed in my life that I can see the runway from my hotel, which is super unique. So I never had such experience. 50 American dollars includes breakfast and this huge room at the same time. And I feel like uh, there's a spa section on this area and they have a huge uh, restaurant area as well which I can actually show you in a while. So I'm gonna change quickly, then we are going for uh, some shopping in the town. See you guys later. Meanwhile, I'm enjoying this incredible view, so I want to take the time to introduce you to my travel partner. I've been traveling for the last two years and half, constantly moving from country to country, and in this such a lifestyle, you do need a reliable partner. In this case, level eight comes to the picture level eight is not only the sponsor of this video but also my most favorite luggage for several reasons number one durability when you are a person like me that packs every single day to move from place to place then you need the reliable luggage number two is the 360 wheels which helps tremendously to travel from place to place especially at the airports and no matter how much weight you have inside it it feels like that luggage is just floating in the air and the reason number three is the amount of space level eight luggages has check this out this handles the base of it comes from the sides it creates much more space in the middle of the luggage unlike other average suitcases which comes in the middle and sacrifice the space inside of it so if you are looking for a new suitcase for your upcoming travels then check out the link in the description of this video access level 8 website and use my code for extra discount now enjoy the rest of the video guys so as soon as you get out of the room you have to walk down to the reception so it's kind of like different floors and they have some rooms, I think, in this area, but as well as on the right side. But my room is right there in the first floor. So I feel like if you get the second floor, you would have even better views to the airport. And in the morning, that's when the flights are happening, when it's the best weather for the flights to land and take off in the mountains, then I think you would have a nice views to the airplanes taking off and landing while you are enjoying your morning coffee sitting at the balcony and enjoying everything about Bhutan so this is little garden area on the left side which looks beautiful and very relaxing it's made out of stones and I feel like they can also do campfire right here for you and you would still enjoy the views and this is their restaurant area check out this architecture is so beautiful every building every uh, property is like this designed with care and love so this is their restaurant area probably they serve the breakfast here very nice and i think we should proceed this way to take the stairs down and there will be a reception and they also have a little cafe area here. Not sure if I'm allowed to go here, but this is their little cafe area. So you can get also coffee here and then still enjoy the views to the mountains. All right, my guide and driver is waiting for me. They have to drop me to the city center. So let's go. Ah, interesting. Douglas Kovan. Chanku Resort's first guest, 19 March 2010. Interesting. That's very interesting. They made kind of like a portrait and photo for him, for his memory, that he was the first guest of the resort. All right, where's the reception? Brother, quick question. Can you give me a double bed? I'm single, but I want double bed. Is it possible? Uh, your room number, I know. Uh, room number is 303. So, we'll see. Yeah. Uh, sorry, sir, we don't have other Okay, no problem. It's all full. Perfect. It's okay. No problem. I will manage it. Thank you. See you. Beautiful. So, if you want to know the name of the hotel, this is the one Kanku Resort. Beautiful, guys. You are enjoying the views? Yeah. All right. I was filming my room and now time to go 
It's great, but uh, they gave me two single beds and I want a double bed, but it's okay. I manage it. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> All right. Yeah, these are the views to the airport and the mountains. It's quite nice weather and I want to do the shopping before sunset. So we're going to go buy some souvenirs. That's what's next, guys. See you later. Correct. AK. Sure. I will be fine. I will be fine. I traveled 41 countries. I will be okay. <laughs> Especially in Bhutan. Thank you guys. See you. Bye bye. Tomorrow. Bye bye. Thank you so much for today. It was great. See you. Bye bye. All right. I convinced my guide and the driver that I want to be on my own and at least experience Bhutan for a while a little bit solo as you know uh, it's a requirement by the government you should have a guide uh, when you're arriving to Bhutan even before you arrive to Bhutan in order to get your visa and stuff like that it's important that you have a, a companion meanwhile you are here it's for your safety it's for your comfort as well as it makes sure that uh, it's it's also the local people who is guide and drivers gets jobs so you don't just come here travel for a budget traveling and take something from the country but not give anything back to the country so i really like the concept but today uh, i wanted to be alone for a while and explore around the city check out what we can find here at the moment we are in the city center of paro and uh, we are surrounded by these beautiful shops and I am looking for some antique stuff, some handmade things. So hopefully we will get a chance to buy a few things, maybe statues, maybe some clothes. That would be that would be great. Mainly I want to get uh, some paintings. Maybe we should go a little bit further and find out. Right in the middle of the square, there is actually a praying wheel. So we might go check that out and say hi. Look at this, such a beautiful square. And uh, when I'm talking about how authentic is this country, one of the things is about the architecture of it. It is so beautiful. Every shop, every property, every business has some type of uh, architecture and uh, old fashion into it. Even they build up uh, new buildings, they still have this old vibes and uh, traditional traditional um, architecture and right here is the is the praying wheel so when you see one never miss the chance to turn it around so you should always do clockwise you just hold it and then pull it around normally it should has a like a bell on top of it so when you do one turn it makes a noise but right now it doesn't have it this looks like a cool place to hang out too. There's actually kids. Hello guys. Is it good place? Yes, it looks nice. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> so it's a nice place for the kids to hang around and enjoy. All right, let's uh, head to the shops and find out. How are you guys? Uh, my name is Davud. Davud, yes. Nice to meet you. What? I make vlog. I make for YouTube. Yes, about Bhutan. I show how beautiful is your country. You are from here? Yes? Okay, nice. Nice to meet you and see you next time. Thank you. So this town, Paro, obviously airport is here, but at the same time it's a beginning and it's also the end of uh, lots of people's trip. And this place is also not too far away, far away from the tiger's nest. So that's why it's very popular. We will see lots of tourists in this area and I see one shop there which I really want to check it out looks beautiful and looks authentic and let's check out what they what they are selling hello how are you I make a YouTube video is that okay I want to check out your shop perfect let's go uh, shoes no shoes Oh, shoes. shoes on okay okay very no nice shoes, everyone will run away <laughs> ah yes no no i i respect the place so i would love to take it off and 
follow the rules. Are you a YouTuber? I am a YouTuber, yes. Wow. Yes, okay. thank you. <laughs> uh, what are this and uh, how do you use them and how much are they? Okay. <laughs> uh, these are all um, bed throws, we call it. Ah, it's throws. for bed. Throws, yeah. I would use it as a, like a blanket. Yeah, you can also use it like a... Or, or, or like a jacket. In Pakistan, like, they just like, uh, sure. yeah, yeah. they wrap it around yeah. themselves and walk around. Yeah. Yes, yeah. I like it. Yeah, uh, you, I mean, it's multi-use. You can okay. use as a, um, as a f on the floor. Ah, like a carpet. Uh, if you don't like it wearing, you can also use it on the wall, wall hanging. Nice. Uh, you can use as a throws, um, sofa cover, uh, so many uses. Okay, you know? beautiful. <laughs> so multi, multi-purpose. Yeah. Beautiful and, and hand woven. Hand woven and the material of it? It's hundred percent wool. Wool, okay. Yes, Is it ship wool? It's ship wool. It's yak wool. Yak wool oh. mix. Yeah. Very beautiful. So, what's the price of this? I'm not gonna buy. I'm just checking the price. Um, because it it's too big. It costs you around four hundred sixty dollars. Four hundred sixty dollars. Wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Because they are special in a way, special because these are all natural color dye, okay, okay. Uh, meaning there's no chemical or synthetic used in it. Okay. Uh, so they are very good for the skin. All right. And and they are very um, customized design, and all handmade. Uh, so it has lot Hard of work. special. I think it makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> yes, uh, you don't have to explain <laughs> yeah. uh, further. It's not like something machine made. And then yes, yes, yeah. Four hundred sixty <laughs> would be too much for it. And. Uh, what about the scarves? I really like what I see. For example, this one. Is this a scarf? I know. Th these ones? Yeah. These are a uh, Bhutanese dress. A uh, Bhutanese dress, dress, like a woman, woman dress. dress. All right. What about the scarves? Uh, um, these are. It's, you, it's the same. Same. Like, yeah, but it's a smaller uh, version, no? Smaller version. Uh, the back of it is uh, shows that how the patterns are being yes, done. Yes. Yes. Very beautiful. Mm -hmm. uh, how much is this one? I really like the yellow this one? color. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's uh, you 12, can Bhutan money. Ah, 12, <coughs> uh, uh, I also have mm -hmm. my 146 in dollars. 12,000 uh, Bhutan money. Okay, so it's approximately for, uh, 82 we Okay, 145 dollars. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. I want to check some of your souvenirs too. Okay. This um, is the first shop I come to, so I want so to... Just so you know, wow. um, I, this store here, um, our, our store, like we try to, we do uh, very authentic collections. Yes, yes. So, like it's when you are from... Picked up stuff, one. Uh, original stuff. Yeah. yeah. Uh, genuine stuff. Yeah. Um, so like, these are old collections. Uh, beautiful. But they are also very authentic collections. Nice. Old collections. Yeah, I, I really like what I see. It's beautiful. Uh, there's some so bracelets what you here. See in the market uh, would be different. What you see yes, here. Yes, yes, yeah. Because these are like mass made, and these exactly. ones are authentic. And Beautiful. Yeah. And we have some more books here. And how do you use this one? These are uh, handmade bamboo baskets. Okay. Uh, mostly we use here Together? in the traditional way uh -huh. uh, for the pack lunch. <laughs> ah. In the festival, you might see yes, yes. if you visit some group eating okay. for lunch. Then you might see something like ah, this. Ah, so lunch. this is like a packed lunch. Yes, traditionally. And you push it inside, and yeah. it becomes like a lid of it. Mm -hmm. But um, nice. Yeah, I understood which, the concept. Yeah. But uh, you can also use it for different purposes. Yeah, like nice, storage. nice. Oh. Don't worry, please. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I got the, I got the concept. Yeah? Yes, yes, oh, perfect. But I want to show you. Yeah, it, it's basically yeah. using as a like like a lid. Yes, this oh, is lid beautiful. and this is thing. Amazing. But Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. What's the name of your shop? I want to give it details. Uh, Where are you from? I'm from Samti, Southern Bhutan. Southern Bhutan. Yeah. Nice. You have uh, Indian features. <laughs> Seriously? Yes. <laughs> Very nice. Uh, but it, it's not bad, right? Yeah, I, no, I, I don't mean bad. anything bad. Yeah, no, 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 <laughs> but South bad. Bhutan is more close to yeah, India, right? Yeah. So then it's I. Yes. Only, yeah. but Bhutan. And you are from which part? Uh, I'm from here. Yeah, from North here, North from the city. All right. This is the name of the shop, USL Handcraft, and uh, they have a number, email, you guys, whatever you want. Do you ship to abroad? Yes, we Perfect. do all those. Perfect. A uh, very old shop. Um, I think 15, 16, 17 years. Okay. Now. 
Oh, amazing. Uh, my other, uh, this is like authentic. Oh my God, I missed that. Okay, okay, you finish your, no, no, you finish, you finish your. Uh, so we have other, our branch, main branch where we started. Uh -huh, that uh -huh. side. Ah, then you moved to you, here. And this is more the authentic we separated from what is mass. Nice, nice. Yeah. So there you have bigger, bigger windows and more modern design. I did miss your this, bus? this, uh, this what is this? No bus. Oh, I thought you said you missed your bus. No, no, no. I missed <laughs> seeing this. Like, I love stuff like that. This is so beautiful. This is a box. How do you use this? Uh, is this, this like a box? Storage box. Storage uh, box. All wood. Mm, I can imagine. Hand, hand painted. Like now we have converse painting, uh -huh. uh, paper painting. Okay. But in olden times, uh, this is the way of painting. This is beautiful. And now, then we can use the furniture and this the lid. Yeah, you just open it, open you can put stuff, stuff there. Wow, yeah. it's incredible. I, I love I love and the... And the painting here is very special. Is the chirim, we call it. Chirim. Meaning, meaning the long life. Long life, okay. Yeah. Nice. Art. Beautiful. <laughs> I love I love everything about Bhutan and especially the artist stuff, which is, which is amazing. All right, thank you so much for your time. I really appreciate it. I will check around and maybe I come back to get something from you. Sure. Thank you so much. Please it's do. been a pleasure. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank All you. the best. <laughs> See you. I can go out from here? Yeah. Perfect. Thank you. Oh, that was lots of information and beautiful shop. Lots of cool stuff. But I want to do a little exploration first to see what are the things I really want to get. Uh, first of all, it has to be authentic and it has to be from Bhutan. That's what I'm looking for because I travel everywhere else in South Asia, especially India. I think some of the products are coming from India here. So, yeah, let's maybe check out this shop right here. Oh, that's very busy inside. Maybe have a look at here. Hello, hi, how are you? Uh, do you have the, ah yeah I see the scarves. Uh, which ones are this from Bhutan? Uh, scarves? Sir? Yes. Like silk maybe, silk and, and made here in Bhutan. Handmade. These are beautiful. This one, some they use as a table cloth and some. A they table use cloth. They like a scarf. See? So it, a yes, one, yeah, and uh, the way it's cut, it shows that it's original, yeah. and. Uh, I'm assuming these ones are from abroad, maybe India? Uh, this one, no idea, sir. This one, our local, they came yeah. here to sell the product. And okay, okay, yeah. nice. Because so they are here because they want money, right? Uh -huh. If I have money, I used to purchase from them. All right, so the scarf, this one, is, is the only one from Bhutan? Uh, like a handmade and uh, silk? This one, yeah, move on, sir. This one, see? Okay. Cotton on, then I see okay. this silk, sir. Beautiful, and how much are this? Uh, this one, 3,500, sir. 2,500, and how long is this? Ah, okay, okay. Pretty long. Beautiful. Thank you. I check other shops. Okay. If I don't find, I come get a few of this. Okay. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. All right. It's very touristy here. Maybe let's check out this shop here. Tara Handicraft. That looks like a huge shop. Oh, looks beautiful. Hello. Hi. I'm looking for some handmade scarves. Hi. You work here? Yes. Oh, nice. Uh, I'm looking for Bhutani handmade, possibly silk scarves. Silk? Yeah. These are silk scarves. Ooh, looks beautiful and feels great. And this ones? Uh, those are made from wool. Wool, okay, okay. But it's Bhutan made? Yes, it is. Okay, everything is Bhutan made here? Oh, uh, yes. Wow, yes. nice. I like I like these uh, patterns. But this is not scarf, right? This is no, more this like a, a dress. dress, like a skirt. These are also scarves. Okay. Can you give me one, like a unique one, one scarf? If, if I have to get really one thing, what would that be? Mm. Special from Bhutan, handmade, uh, silk or wool, doesn't matter in this case. Unique. Is this dress? Yeah, it's upper part of the dress, yes. right? Okay. What about we look at here? Ah, oh, this is also beautiful. Yeah. How much are this? Hand embroidery. That's for ten thousand five hundred. Ten thousand five hundred. All of them. Yeah. Okay. So this is. I like this one. And I like. So from. From this, and this. 
If it, if you had to get anything from Bhutan, what would you buy? <laughs> you mean only from those? Yeah, two? from two two choices, oh. like from this style or that style. That one. That one. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Can you show me a few of this? I will buy. Oh, uh, we have more here. I'll show you. Ah, you have the open ones. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. Here. Oh, that looks great. And what's the price of this? This one is for 15,000. 15,000. Yeah. So, it's handmade yes. wool yeah. from Bhutan. Wool, yes. Perfect. It clicks all the my criteria. <laughs> it's great. So, if I go for silk, it will be much more expensive than this, yeah, right? This, uh, this one is also silk. Uh, this is also silk. Yeah. Oh, perfect. So, 15,000 is uh, how much? I'm going to just check quickly. So, it's 180 american dollars so um do you have a little bit cheaper than that um maybe around hundred dollar mark like ten thousand ten thousand uh, this was 180. uh that one is for so this is ten thousand and this is also silk yeah no this is wool this is wool yeah. all right Okay, I'm gonna get uh, one of them. I think that's the best thing I can get. Do you do discounts here? Yes, we do, sir. Yeah. You ha oh, we have more choices if you want to see some more. Oh yeah, I would love to. Give me like three choices, then I choose from there. Sure. <laughs> this was very beautiful, for sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hello. Hi. Hi guys, how are you? We are fine, yeah. about you? I'm great. I'm can you help me to I choose color? Are you working here or I'm talking yeah, to I'm customer? No, I'm working Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> that would be weird. <laughs> oh, nice. Uh, this has the kind of yeah, like a butas. Does this has a meaning for you? Uh, no, no, it's just a pattern. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that pattern is very famous in uh, Mughal Empire. Do oh. you know Mughal Empire? It's from India and uh, Iran, Afghanistan. Oh. Actually, this also comes from the southern part of the Bhutan. Yes. So, uh, in the southern part of the Bhutan, you will find Nepalese, but we don't call them Nepalese. Bhutanese people are yeah. uh, like they are called um, what do you say, Lotham. Yes, yeah, okay, okay. So Understood. Perfect. So we have one choice like mm -hmm. this, and we have one That's choice like that. And then this one was very beautiful Lapis too. Is not only Oh, this is very nice. Okay, uh, I think I take this one, please. Okay. Thank you. Can you open it one more time for me, like a full? So both sides is is the same, right? Yeah. Very beautiful. All right, we go for this. Thank you. We have more stuff in there. Yes. All right, I would love to have a look your shop. Wow, this part is so impressive. Look at this. Wow, this this thing screams expensive. How much are this? I'm not gonna buy because I don't have a luggage for this. <laughs> so it's for 550,000 in Oh, 450. Okay, what's the most expensive thing you have in the shop? <laughs> You said 550,000. Yeah. So it comes to 6,600 6, dollars. Impressive. Yeah. Are this like yes, these like precious stones? Handmade. Yeah, these are precious stones plus these handmade. are handmade. Yeah, handmade. Beautiful. It looks great. And what's the material of that? Brass. Okay. Beautiful. So do you want to show me what's the most ex Oh, wow, that's huge. This is the Buddha statue and Luxon. <laughs> Might be this one. Oh, uh, that's for like. What is this? Three fifty million? No, ah, three point yeah. five million. Yeah. Three point five million. Wow. There are so many great things here. I think I chose the good shop to come. <laughs> I love it. I want to see uh, how much this thing costs. So okay. three point. So it's basically forty-two thousand American dollars. Wow. How do you ship this? If I buy this, how do you ship it? We do 
to DHL. DHL? DHL gonna ship this? Yes. Wow, what's the material of this? This one is made from copper. Copper? Yeah. Wow. So you spend $42,000 and then probably 10,000 10, American dollars for shipping, I guess. Oh, <laughs> but it's impressive. Very beautiful. Has, I guess, some precious stones on it. Yes, sir. Incredible. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Oh, you have another room here. These are basically the masks and some antique stuff. Wow, this shop is incredible, guys. I think you can come here, purchase so many beautiful uh, decorations for your house and just go home. You don't have to go anywhere else. Very impressive, but prices are screaming really expensive, but all of them are authentic. And of course we are in a touristic place, so there's a little bit of margin on it. Do you have also upstairs? Paintings, I would love to see your paintings. Thank you. So we go upstairs. Seems like we're gonna do all our shopping here. Wow, these are some uh, wall covers basically. And then this is the paintings area. Wow, is this the best shop in in the city? Best shop, I don't know, like, but big biggest? Is the biggest, I can see. You have everything guys here, it's incredible. Oh, live painting is going on there. I would love to see that. Hello. Hi, guys. Not impressed. How are you guys? I would love to see what you do. Is that okay? Wow. Quite a hard work is going on here. This one is huge. Beautiful. Nice. Do you have some realistic paintings, like a village painting of Bhutan or uh, sorry, we don't have only religious ones? Yeah. Okay, so everything is religious here. Yeah. Wow, they are impressive. So big. What about this type? Four prints? Uh, this type. Okay. Uh, what's the price of this, for example? This one is 250,000. 250,000. 200. No, three fifty. Three fifty. Ah, three fifty. Yeah, three fifty. So it will be around four thousand dollars. Okay, that's the price we are looking at. Great. And this all hand, this, yeah, like handmade and painted in Britain. Like gold, and uh, this one is like the white one is with the silver. Silver. Yeah. The, the, which is the white? Here. Ah, this is white. This is yeah. silver, and this is golden. Yeah. Like a golden, like they use literally gold, or you mean golden like, water? No, no, gold only, like 24 karat gold. Really? Yeah. Wow. This is around like painting, like not like normal painting. We can feel this kind of 3D painting. Beautiful. Yeah. Looks great. Thank you. But you don't have realistic paintings, right? Uh, no. Yes. All right. Perfect. Then we can go. I will just take the scarf and maybe check out the other shops as well. But since we are here, let me show you guys what these rooms are filled of with such an impressive artworks in every corner here. Even they have little rocks here with the dragons on it. Are you selling this or also? Oh yeah, like these are antique ones. Antique old ones? Yeah, ah, okay. old ones. Old ones. Yeah. So this is from Bhutan, right, as well? As I can see dragons there on it. Beautiful. And then I'm sure every painting has some meaning behind it. Is this the... Um, like this uh, kind of here, like this one is uh, Guru Rinpoche and the outer man one is the like prayers of him. So like, is this a mantas like written all of them or is, like you... This, this is a repeated one. Repeated, okay. Yeah, and also here you can see like this one is God of Health, like sorry well. And God uh, of wealth. Yeah, wealth. Okay. And the outer one is the prayers of him. Similar to all of Yeah, this. so each of them has a meaning. So whatever you want to bring to your house, you buy that type of painting, I guess, right? Yeah. If it's about wealth, health, or... Yeah, and, and also, like, uh, we have uh, one 
we all have for one god we all like we have a birth year right uh -huh. so i'm born in 2001 so mine one is like buddha okay so it's based on like years which you are born so all right based on that like we all have to god so more like astrological connection yeah, yeah, yeah. to it too you are from 2001 yeah wow. so 2001 <laughs> is uh, like buddha Okay, okay. I'm not used to hear I'm from 2001. I'm used to hear from 1990 something, not 2000. <laughs> Even 19, from 19, we have to like birth year, so there must be one gut. Yeah, no, no, I'm just impressed at how young you, how young you are, and I realize how old I am getting from the 90s kids. <laughs> Thank you so much for everything. Wow, they have so much antique stuff here too. Are you selling this too, or is this for like... Yeah. Sailors. Oh, you say no photography, but this is videography. It's okay, no? <laughs> Thank you. All right, we go downstairs. I pay for the um, uh, the scarf, please. You stay here? Yeah. All right, it was nice to meet you. Thank you so much and all the best. Bye bye. All right, let's go and pay for our scarf, which is around 180 American dollars. But I think that's gonna be the best gift I can get from here. Uh, I'm ready uh, for the payment. Okay. Uh, how do we do this? Thank you so much. You can pay I pay cash to you guys. Thank you. Uh, can you? Can, yeah. Ah, you give me discount. Oh, thank you so much. So it comes to thirteen thousand five hundred. Can you please check how much is here? So we need fourteen. Ah, uh, there's twelve. So thirteen, fourteen, yeah. Thank you. You will pack it nicely for me, please? Yeah, I can put it in the bag, please. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. So we are getting uh, around 1,500 discount and it comes to 13,500 and the final price is 162. Is there uh, any information where this comes from? I heard it's from south, southern part of Nep uh, Bhutan, right? Okay. Can I have a look later? Thank you. Very beautiful shop. I loved it. Thank you so much for the tour. Would you like to promote your shop? What's the name of it? My shop, Tara. Tara Handicraft. Ah, okay. I, I, I see it from outside. Okay, it's better. Thank you, guys. All the best. Bye bye. All right, guys, this was the name of the shop, Tara Handicraft, and they have the number there. I'm sure you can find it also on Google easily. Beautiful shop. I'm so impressed. Let's use the zebra. Cross like uh, humans. As, but, uh, as Bhutan is a very cultural country, you have to respect the rules and cross the street accordingly even though in the first street crossing i crossed from wherever all right i'm looking for some paintings i think that would be our goal to get something let's check out here what we have hi guys hello do you have any realistic paintings uh, no religious but like a village village uh, village? Yes, village paintings. No. Where I can find in the street? Uh, I have no idea. You can go the okay. street up there. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Next. Bye, guys. Next. <laughs> next one. Yeah, next. Straight and on the left, yeah, right? Next. next left. Okay. All right, perfect. Thank you so much. All right, let's find some realistic paintings, guys. Oh, look at this beautiful village. I don't know if I can call it village, city, but it's super impressive, super beautiful. Ah, this is where it's our paintings. Hi, how are you? 
Very good. Thank you so much. Uh, I see that no photography, but I make a YouTube video. Is that okay? Yes. I would like to see your realistic paintings, like a possibly village. That would be impressive. Do you have upstairs? Yeah, we have. Oh, okay. Like, um, like these paintings, like smaller ones. Yeah, no, but. Obviously, we don't have this kind of modern painting, but we have uh, only this yeah, ones. Yeah, I don't want really, really religious, religious yeah, ones, yeah, but yeah. a real, like a real painting. Yeah, yeah, it's a painting. Yeah, like things like things like this. No, you don't have upstairs. No. Okay, only here. Yeah. Oh, okay. But we do have a traditional painting like this type of mandalas. Okay. Okay. You okay. Want to see? I see it. Okay. Just because you are nice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, back at, I'm still interested in the realistic paintings, but happy to see what you have. Wow, very beautiful. This is our artist studio. Ah, yeah, Go artist studio, it. very nice. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Right yes, I can see it. Beautiful, thank you so much. No shoes, huh? No, so you can go with shoes. Yeah? Okay, yes, thank you. Hello, guys. Hello, hello. Wow, these are really big ones. Real work is going on. Beautiful. Ashi Delek, guys. Thank you. Thank you. And then we have the this corner too. Very beautiful. So colorful as well. Nice. So realistic paintings are only downstairs, right? Yes, sir. Right. Perfect. Thank you so much. Very nice to meet you. Okay, I'm gonna take the stairs without falling. Hopefully, hello. How are you? Good, good. How are you? Very good, brother. Thank good you. Shopping? Ah, uh, yes. So far. <laughs> Guys, do you have by any chance mini version of these paintings? No, we don't have. Only this. Uh, yeah, okay. Do you know where I can find in the street? Uh, Should I walk straight? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, Thank you. All the best. You've been very kind. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, people. Shopkeepers are so nice here. Even considering they see millions of tourists every single day here. But they are still so kind and have time to chat and show you exactly where you need to be. Beautiful. All right, maybe here, but I see repetitively the same type of paintings all over the place. But I'm looking for something more realistic, so let me find that type of shop, guys, and then I connect with you rather than just wandering around purpose, purposeful, purposefulness, whatever is that word. So I want to find it purposefully and then afterwards I connect with you guys. See you later. Seems like we reached to the end of the street here, but I haven't found anything. Let's, sorry, sorry guys. Let's have a look at here maybe. Hi guys. Hello. Do you have paintings? No. Pa yeah, painting? No. Where, where I can find paintings? Like, but, but realistic, realistic paintings. Yes, straight. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay, I think all we have to do is go one by one and check out them to see what are the options we have. Hello. Hi. Do you have a realistic paintings? Painting? Yes. Yes. Like a village or something no, like that? No. Only religious. religious yes. Yeah, okay. Where I can find non religious uh, paintings? You can find in the uh, painting house. Sir. Painting house. It's just straight. 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 All right, perfect. Thank you so much. Okay, seems like we have to go more further. All these shops are very beautiful and, and I think everything is unique. Whatever you are putting your hands on, it will be very nice. Hi guys. By any chance, do you have realistic paintings? Yes? Yes, but no religious. No religious? Yeah. Only realistic paintings? Yes. Uh, we have in four kinds. Sorry, sir, no. I don't have. Can I see your shop? Yes. Sir. Thank you. Antiques inside. Beautiful. That looks like a great start of 
Wow, beautiful music in the background and all these antique things here. Very beautiful. And this is the paintings you were talking about, yeah? It's all religious, no? Yes. Wow, I love this. Is this the praying spot? Uh, yes. Like in the, in the houses, you have this yeah. shelf yeah. for praying. Yeah. Okay. Exactly. Very beautiful. I, lo yeah. I love and it. And the interesting thing about this is there is no single nail on it. Ah, so it's yeah. just... It's just fixed very wood. without the nail here. Wow, impressive. Very impressive. And all the colors of it and how it's designed attention to detail is incredible uh, I think I shouldn't step on this yeah it's okay right. so this is the basically the similar type of paintings we have already seen oh we have a is this a Bhutanese musical instrument yeah we call it drum yam drum yam yeah drum yam so this is an incomplete one broken one ah it's broken here yeah it's broken here Oh, beautiful. That looks incredible. Thank you so much for letting me be here. Ah, this is the praying wheel, no? Yes, sir. Do you have a smaller one? We have, yes. And how expensive? Ah, oh, no, this is still too big. Do you have yeah. smaller than that? Yeah. It doesn't have to be antique. It yeah. can be new. These shops takes you to, to the past. It's like this. Like traveling in the... And as a time. Boss, how are you? So far, so good, sir. You are the boss? No, no, mini boss. Mini boss. The ladies right. are the boss. I think you know Yes, better. exactly. Wives are always, always the boss. Better. Yes, exactly. And then you will get the happiness. <laughs> exactly, yes. Otherwise, happy, no happiness. Happy wife, happy life. Happiness. Always. Happiness. So same in your country. Uh, sorry? So same? Ah, same in all over the world. Ah, yes. okay. It's a woman. Only in Bhutan. No, 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 everywhere. It's ah, a woman okay. power. Happy to hear that. Yes, yes, yes. You are not you are not exceptional. Everywhere is like that. Wow, okay. Thank you. Good news for everybody. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I like this, but I have seen uh, green ones. Green Do you have the green ones? Uh, no, sir. No, okay. Perfect. Okay. Boss, you can help me to find uh, realistic paintings in this street? Yes, yes. Where? Yes. Where? But you have to pay me. Okay, how much? I, gi <laughs> I give you a hug. Is that okay? <laughs> oh, beautiful. How much is this one? This one is for how much? 4,000. 4,000, like this? Yeah, stand Oh, beautiful. You get the stand along with that. Ah, you get the stand. Can you put it like that? Yeah. Beautiful. Is this a... Uh, how original is this? Handmade or...? It's a handmade. Handmade, perfect. Handmade, but new one. New one, yeah. yeah. Beautiful, I love this. Do you have any other version that I can compare or it's only one yeah. version? Then I show you the Please, thank you so much, thank you. We have that. Ah, incredible. Ah, there's also this one. Yes, it's a pray wheel. Pray wheel. Yes. Oh, so this one you just put it on the shelf yeah. and stays there. Yes. But this one is like, you rotate. Uh, this is a smaller version. No, I like the green ones. I really like the green ones. Okay, all of these are same price? Yes, sir. 4,000, 4,000? Yes, sir. What's your favorite yes, from all these four? Be... You choose one. Green. Ah, there's also one version here. Yes. Okay, I think I like the bluish here. Yeah, yeah. We take this. This one? Yes, thank you so much. Same price still? Yes, sir. All right. It was 4,000, right? Yes, sir. 4,000. Four, four so we are looking at here 48, 48 American dollars. Hello, uh, hi, welcome. She is the big boss now. Uh, she's the boss. She's the boss. Uh, she's the boss. She's the, boss. She's the wife. Yeah. No, 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 no. I just pay and go, guys. Kuzu, Kuzu, where are you? Kuzu, Kuzu. Where? Dragon. Where is the dragon? 
Uh, from here, you have to walk down the street. Down the street, until down the, the street. where's the praying wheel? Yes, oh, and you can see one mountain cafe down there. Yes, mountain, mountain cafe, cafe. Yeah. And also there is a one street, small yes. street. And opposite to that, you can see the big building there called Dragon Handicraft. Dragon Handicraft, yeah. it's a and realistic painting. Realistic. Perfect, yeah. okay, I go there straight. Okay. So, I don't down floor here, have the same stuff as me. And the first floor here, have the same thing. <laughs> All right, I will I will check yeah. it out. Dragon shop. Yes. Dragon around the shop. praying wheel. Ah, around the opposite. Opposite. Yeah. opposite. Okay. Yes. Opposite on the on yes. the other side. Yes. Ah, okay, okay. All right, I checked that out. Nice. I will I will go there. Even he participated in many I mean competition competition. Oh yeah. Okay, I go there straight. No no sacrifices. Straight there. I'm also not a great one. He do himself. Okay, perfect. Dragon dragon shop. Dragon handicraft. Dragon handicraft. Thank you so much. Thank you. If you ask the shop, they can show you. Okay, I will check it out. Okay. Thank you so much. You've been super kind to help me and show everything around. Thank you. And a very beautiful shop. Well done, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. All the best. See you next time. Thank you. All right, we made another business here. It was around 48 American dollars. And this is the name, Kuzu Souvenir. Okay, I'm gonna go back to where we have started, guys. That's my objective. I think I've already got what I needed for now. But I want to look at the paintings. That's gonna be the last thing I want to really purchase. So let's find the dragon shop and I connect with you later on, guys. The sun slowly setting in the background of the mountains. And I can see that we do find the dragon handicrafts right here, which is in front of us. So. We have only one objective, so let's go check it out and see what we have here. Dragon handicrafts. I love Bhutan. Hello, hi, hello, hi guys. I've been asking all around, where is the realistic paintings? They said dragon handicrafts. Is that correct place? Yes, <laughs> who is the famous guy? Paintings. They said he went for competitions and stuff like that. No? no? Okay. Do you have realistic paintings? No re no religious. Like uh, we just have religious paintings. Ah, no, I want I want you realistic. Want con contemporary paintings. Yes, like a village of Bhutan or something like that. We like a yak and mountains, stuff like that. You can go to that shop. It's a dragon gift. Ah, so it's the same name, Dragon Gift. Yeah, dragon okay. gift you go upstairs. A dragon gift upstairs. Yes. It seems closed. Uh, it's open. Yeah, people are yeah, doing some work. Ah, okay, okay. Okay, I go check it out. Thank you so much. See you guys. All the best. All right, we were wrong dragon place. We have to go to the other one, guys. So, which is on the opposite side. Hi. Are you doing TikTok dance? Yes. <laughs> well done, guys. Okay. And this is the one dragon gift. That should be the one we should follow. Is there a zebra here? There's no zebra here. We're gonna cross, breaking the rules. Okay, it's a traffic anyway, so let's go for it. All right, we just arrived. I think upstairs gonna be the paintings which we are looking for. So let's go check it out. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi, guys. Hi. I've been searching all over the place for realistic paintings. Uh, realistic paintings? Upstairs? Yeah, upstairs. Can I see that? Yeah, you, you perfect. can. Perfect. No, you can go from outside. Ah, I have to go outside? Yeah. Okay, okay. Perfect. It's from close here. All right, perfect. Thank you. Go right, right? Okay. All right. Seems like a shop. We have to go from this side. I really put lots of effort to find these paintings. I have seen it in many places actually, but not here. But this place looks like under construction. Let's go one more floor maybe up. Maybe here. Hello. Hi. This is literally someone's house. Hi, hi, hi. Uh, paintings? 
of hitting. Yes, downstairs? Yeah, but uh, we are actually closed. Not, not closed, but we are cleaning actually. Cleaning? Can yeah. I see still your paintings? Oh, we have a whole few paintings actually. Oh, yeah? Okay. Yeah, so we have. All right. Like Nothing left. Are you the famous guy who went to the competitions? No? Competition. Are you the painter? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so you did all of this? Yeah, I went to China for exhibition. Yes, that's what, yeah, that's what people were talking about you. They said, go and check with him. He's going to have amazing things. Uh, Thank so you. I've got only these pieces now. All right. So wow, everything is uh, sold out? Kind of. Oh, I love this. If you had a mini version of this, I would love to buy it. Uh, Smaller? Oh, no. Okay. How much do you sell this for? These are 15,000 each. 15,000 each? Yeah, our local currency. Wow, beautiful. And uh, how does it work? You take out the frame? Yeah, yeah. You and take it the frame and... And then I, I would uh, pack it in a cardboard. Okay. So then I'll sell it a bit. So, All right. Yeah. Uh, let me see what's the price. Because I cannot really find good paintings and this seems like the best thing I can <laughs> Thank get. Thank you so much. <laughs> Fifteen thousand is around hundred eighty American dollars. Yeah. Would you mind um, giving me one best one? Like, what's your favorite and why? Oh. I know it's like choosing between your children, which one you love the most. Oh, I like it. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know. Yeah. But I like this one as well. But uh, yes, but I like the f the when they have the a fa colors. face on it. Is the is oh. the Buddha Buddha always right or yeah, different yeah, yeah. different? This one this one is different, right? Yeah, this is different. This, this is, is not Guru, Buddha. Guru Padmasambhava. Okay. So actually, who founded the Tiger's Nest? Okay. Yeah. So I usually paint uh, Buddhist motifs and symbols actually. Okay. Okay. Yeah. yeah, that's completely fine for me. I, to be honest, this one catched my attention because yeah. of the color combinations: blue, green, and exactly. uh, red. So what I have done here is I have painted the five elements color of five elements of the but buddhism the, yes and at the same time so i've got a more of like red and the black the reason being is black is considered as a hatred and red is anger you know that two poisons can be only suppressed or subdued by means of compassion then i've got a mantra of compassion here so 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 then i've got a little white here uh -huh. so that actually symbolizes that in every human we have got a buddha nature within ourselves but it's obscured or it's, it's, it's like covered up by the anger and hatred, you know? Okay. So if you can get rid of this one, the black and red, then you are likely to discover the white. Then. White one. Yeah. Then that's the reason why the Buddha is behind all the, the way The way you explain it to me, I have no other way but buy it. <laughs> Let's do it. I have, we have a deal. Thank you so much. We have a deal. Let's do Thank it. You. Thank you so Even much. your shop is under construction, <laughs> but I want to still buy something from you. Oh, thank you so much. Thank it's you. Really kind of no, 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 no. You are kind <laughs> to allow, allow me to come. Is this your house upstairs? Uh, that's actually, yes. Business and house together? Uh, yeah, I, I, uh, I do business, but I live somewhere else. Ah, you live somewhere yes. else. All right. Thank you uh, so much. Thank you, thank you. So I'll uh, ask the help down below. Ah, you're downstairs in the shop. Yeah. All right. Uh, thank you. Then I come downstairs, I pay there, yeah? All right, perfect. Wow, so much struggle. I've been looking for like maybe 30 minutes for nice painting and we didn't get the realistic one. We still get the religious one, but the, the way gentleman explained it, I have no other way but pay $180 to get this incredible marketing and incredible person and Beautiful talent for sure. So that's what we are getting, guys. All right, our painting is beautifully packed. Thank you so much. You're welcome, sir. So, Thank you for of course, I haven't paid you still. <laughs> so this is this is no no it's good. This is how it's packed for for uh, flights, putting it on my luggage, and uh, here's. 15,000, please, Thank you very much. please check it Thank if it's you. correct. Yes, sir. yes, amazing, perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. You've been very kind. I think, would you like to put it in? Oh, no, I think it's okay. I will okay. carry it all together. Sure. Thank you, all the best and Thank nice you. to meet you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, I think we have filled up the whole plan for today. This was the shop, guys, Dragon's Gift. Art and Gallery, Paro Town. Incredible. I think I have the best gifts and uh, best presents from Bhutan already. Bye bye, guys. See you.
All right, guys, as the sun's setting slowly, it's getting dark and I will go buy some fruits and snacks and get to hotel and relax. Tomorrow is another big day here in Bhutan, which I'm very, very excited about. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time, guys. Bye-bye from Bhutan for now.